Hey guys, what is up? I want to show you my squad builder. Three million coin team that I use for foot champs and of course division rivals. And I just want to tell you guys, it's amazing. In net, what am I doing? I've gone past him. Courtois, solid, solid goalkeeper. Even pro players use this guy. He's fantastic. He's really, really good. I think I've got the... What can I say here? The trio... The trio of dreams, man. Okay, next to him, obviously, we're going to have Ramos and Varane. You guys know this, man. These three are absolutely brilliant. Your defense is pretty much covered with these three. Sergio Ramos, absolute bull. His interception strength and his tackling, especially his slide tackling is on point. Now, Rafael Varane brings a lot to the table, especially when it comes to pace. Like, this guy's got ridiculous pace for a, for a centre-back. He's absolutely brilliant. In right-back, I've got... Sorry, he's untradeable. So, oh, there he is. Sergi Roberto, who's really, really good somehow. He just knows how to defend. He's got a decent height, and he's just always there, just wanting to defend for you. Marcelo in left-back. Marcelo's really talented in this game, especially with them high-low work rates that... They're not very favourable for a left-back, but just stay, stay back whilst attacking on him, on his instructions. Five-star skills, very, very talented left-back. Left in left-mid, we're going to have Neymar. Now, Neymar is sensational in this game. Hands down, one of the most sensational players in this game. He's absolutely brilliant. There's just something about Neymar, his pace, his skills, the way he plays, the way he just does everything for you. Okay, central midfielders, I've got Rabiot, and Rabiot's really good in this game. If you guys haven't played with him, you don't need to buy his blue card, his UCL Champions League card. You don't need that. I've just got that because I had money. But seriously, you do not need to buy him. His normal card's amazing, and Sergio Busquets. This guy is absolutely sensational. Honestly, he is absolutely brilliant. 91 pace or something he's got some crazy defending and he's got crazy shooting ability and he's very good at interceptions right mid obviously the one and only gareth bale absolute beast in this game seriously he's worth so much more than 375,000 coins that are paid for him or something like that he's just amazing honestly he costs so he's so good his strike, I'm going to have Luis Suarez, who's one of the best strikers, hands down. I know he hasn't got the most pace, but give this guy a chance and he will bury it. His finesse shots are out of this world and he's a massive aerial threat. There's a lot Suarez brings to the table as a striker, amazing attack positioning, amazing shot. He's lost his four-star skills, unfortunately. My, my left striker is actually a right forward, so there he is, Kylian Mbappe. So this is my team, Mbappe, Suarez, Bale, Sergio, uh, Busquets, Rabia, and this guy is sensational by the way, Mbappe, and what a delight it was to me, for me to use him. He's one of my favourite players in world football, I actually love this guy to bits, he's absolutely a star and a half, he is sensational. So this is my team, it is a 3 million coin team, we're going to go up against this and uh, let's see how... We get along, by the way, that is a very nice team, that. I do like his Tony Cruz. Tony Cruz is amazing in this game. I like the way he's got a nice hybrid. Okay, as you can see, my opponent is 1-0 up. Okay, there we go, he goes to Rabiot. Rabiot on the ball, passes it to Mbappe. This is one thing really good about this team. And there we go, what a finish that is. The thing is... One thing I absolutely love about this team is the pace on the wings is just too much. Left backs, right backs, you don't have a chance. Centre backs don't have a chance to catch him up. And essentially all the people going up forward besides Suarez have got 90 pace. There's Rabiot, look at the way he cut that ball out. Look at, look at Mbappe there with a bit of skill there. And that's a lovely cross there. And there we go. And there's Neymar finishes that off. Now, that's the thing that I'm trying to say here. The pace on the wing is so much that people finding it really hard to catch him up. And 
it's not just the pace, it's the dribbling and the skills of the wingers as well that makes a huge difference. There's Busquets finding Bale. Bale with a bit of a scoop turn. Bale with a drag back. And there he goes. There we go. Suarez exactly with what I was saying before actually being an aerial threat. Luis Suarez will bury him and he is very, very clinical in this game. I think he's got 94 finishing, if I'm right in saying. There's Neymar, pass to Rabiot, Rabiot, Suarez, just finesse it in. It's so easy to play with Suarez, honestly. This guy is very, very good. I highly recommend him. There's Mbappe, people trying to catch him up. But that, 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 that's what I'm saying. You're not catching the wingers. And that's why I say this team is so good. It's solid at the back. The mids are very, very good. 91 mid 91 pace midfielders that is something else unfortunately Neymar missing that now I've got a problem actually in this game I do hit the bar a lot just be careful boys try not to hit the bar I hit a bar a lot can I give you a tip on pennies just go in the middle I find it hard to score penalties whenever I've gone in the middle I've scored I know it's weird penalties are hard to score Suarez on the ball, finding Neymar, Neymar to Bale, Neymar back to Neymar, Bale on the wing, oh, Bale gets tackled. Who's that? Oh, and there we go, oh, Neymar, but that is Suarez right there, Neymar hitting the bar again, I tell you, Neymar's got an issue in this game, he likes hitting the bar a bit too much, but he is sensational, thank you very much for watching, this is my 3 million coin team. It is very, very good and I can prove that it's good because I'm now in Division 3 now. As I speak right now, I'm in Division 3 and it's made me go into Division 3 because of how good the team is. I was in Division 4 now here, but now I'm on Division 3. What a team. If you guys have got the money, please make it. It is a sensational squad. Thank you very much for watching. Please like and subscribe and peace.